Hi, I'm Paula, and today the takeaways that I took from the course from Donald was that he said to build trust both with sellers and with your buyers. Basically, the rapport that you create with them is probably one of the most important things because you can lose it all, but at the end of the day, you can build everything back up with the relationships you have. And with Christopher, I took out a lot of things as usual. The personal, um, the professional, and the client stories were incredible. Donald and Chris as a team and as coaches, that's a lethal combination. Those two together are going to do some serious damage across the world, and their name is going to be known worldwide here soon. So you better get in now before it's too late and they don't have the ability to help you. Yeah, so Christopher Kai was a, was a great speaker. You know, he's very knowledgeable. Uh, he brings great energy. You know, the game that he was giving us was was worth the money that I spent to come here. You know, I'm leaving with more than I came in with, uh, and I honestly think it was undervalued. Man, Don is one of the most genuine people I've ever met, if not the most genuine person I've ever met in my entire life, man. He honestly wants to see every single person in front of him win, progress, and, you know, honestly wants to help people, not just for his own benefit or what you can get out of it at the end of the day. He's a genuine dude, and he just wants to help people. Uh, I think Donald and Christopher, uh, from the moment I met them, uh, been just really solid dudes just from the jump and um, it's one thing when I just personally think they're a solid dude it's really easy to be a solid dude when you know you first meet someone that's kind of just that's kind of just human nature one-on-one -on -one, you're a nice guy but um, what stands out to me is the way that other people speak about them I think that goes and tells you a lot about what someone can do for you. Uh, it was just amazing uh, meeting Don and Chris uh, they taught us a lot of information about uh, wholesaling and networking uh, one of the most key things I've learned today is like you have to be bold, uh, you have to add value. No, I'm out here with uh, Donald Payne and Christopher Kai. Uh, what a great time, make millions in real estate. We out here right now, we had dinner, we had lunch and dinner, we had the VIP section, you know, we had the VIP for sure, for sure. Uh, man, and they were just dropping jewels the whole time, man, dropping jewels the whole time, telling you about OPM, uh, just different ways to leverage it, just different ways to wholesale, flip. Uh, you know, I have zero experience. The only thing I've done is flip the trailer through a friend, so I have zero experience. And uh, right now, I feel like I can conquer the world. I mean, I always feel like that, but right now, I feel a lot more motivated and just a lot more inspirational, just a lot, a lot more ambition. You know what I mean? You know, one thing about Don, he is a true, genuine person. You know, every time you see him, he says your name, he shakes your hand. He's very knowledgeable. You know, we were just actually talking about, you know, how he could help me, and I haven't even started yet. So, you know, that just tells you the type of guy he is. Uh, so he's just a great person to be around. You know, very appreciative to be here, and I learned from you know, the best, you know? <laughs> Incredible. I mean, I admire both of them greatly, and just having the time to really pick their brains in a classroom setting was incredible. I learned a lot of different things about real estate. Me coming from starting at square one with real estate, this is kind of like my first thing that I've done in the directions towards moving into the field of real estate. Uh, I learned a lot. Like This is just like a huge step in my life. It's like a giant. Not Goliath, you feel me? But yeah, like I said, man, tap in with Donald Payne, man. He's really dropping them gems. Christopher Kai, he's really pushing people, man. They push it to the limit. No Rick Ross.